<laughs> hey, Porter. I just got a, another comment today about how it's cruel to put you in a sweater. I think that's like the fourth one today. Well, what? Dan? Now, nah, that roof just ain't nailed tat. Hey, everyone. I'm Andy, and these are my Chihuahua dogs. This is my dog, Porter, a.k.a. the Kicking Chicken. Well, if I'm kicking, that means I'm going to get some chicken. Or maybe some cheese. <laughs> and my other dog, Polly, a.k.a. Oh, a.k.a. she's getting hissed at. <laughs> a.k.a. Why do the squirrels run away from me? I just want to be their friends. And today we're talking about how cool I am. I'm a cruel man for putting Porter in the sweater. I don't think there's a day on YouTube in the last six months where someone hasn't said that it's cruel to put him in his sweater. Oh, I just hit that sunglass. I don't know. Apparently it's causing him pain in some way. They, of course, never tell you. Last week, one person actually said, why do foreigners always put their dogs in clothes? I was like, <laughs> I uh, determined that they were from Texas. And I was like, buddy, I'm from the United States. I do currently live in Canada, but uh, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> Chihuahua dogs, you come back inside. It's actually getting kind of warm out here. Anyway, I don't know what these people are really thinking, but have you seen Porter? Have you seen Canada? It's kind of a cold place. Oh, pony dogs. I'm not like some person who's like, oh yeah, we gotta play dress up with our dogs and yeah, so cute. Nope, not me. It's all functional. Just like in the wind in the summertime, Polly Dog wears a shirt so that she can cover up her bald spot so that it doesn't get sunburned. Because yeah, we were doing it practical. This is a practical thing. Chihuahua dogs. No, that's not to say that <laughs> I don't like him to look nice when he's being practical. We have a lot of sweaters just so that, you know, when he goes out, all the, the lady chihuahuas will <laughs> see his fancy clothes. Anyway, I would just love to hear from these people directly what their rationale is, because they never seem to give it when they say these things on the internet. Well, don't they know that I'm cold? They don't know Porter? I would challenge these folks <laughs> if they think it's cruel to put a sweater on Porter. Well, I would like to see them go outside just in their shorts in minus 20 Fahrenheit and just uh, hang out for like 10 minutes and, you know, come back and tell me how you feel. Porter dog doesn't think that would feel good, Poopa. Porter's basically hairless. Look at Polly, if you look at her fur, Polly's got some nice, she's got some good thick fur. Porter, <laughs> on the other hand, oh, if we, if we, he, I mean, it's a very, very thin layer, and, you know, he's balding over time, too, on top of it. And it's not just the extreme temperatures, either, it's just being around the house. If he's not wearing a sweater, he's sitting there shivering, or... Sitting in the shot in the sun, <laughs> the sun, or under a blanket or something like that, and even then he's still pretty cold. The moment you put a sweater on him, it improves significantly. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say today. Powder, do you want to say anything to your fans? Well, well, I just want y'all to know that life's a lot better when your dad puts on your sweater. Don't don't worry about those people; they don't know what they're talking about. And well, don't forget that. Hitting the like button is kind of like giving me some virtual G's. And, well, you know I like G's. And y'all have a fantastic day.